This is Mari Lane from the Vine Space Channel. Today I'm reading from the Holy Bible from the New Living Translation in the New Testament. I'm in chapter Matthew of my series about Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Today I'm starting chapter 7 in Matthew. And the title of the section is Do Not Judge others. And I want to extend this reading in honor of Kathy Corner, who apparently is going to shut down her channel because others have attacked and judged her. And I want to dedicate this reading today to Kathy's Corner, or Kathy Corner. In every um, segment of the Sermon on the Mount, which is chapters 5, 6, and 7, I go back to chapter 5, verse 1, and read. So I'm going to read 5, 1, and then go to the beginning of chapter 7, which is a continuation of the Sermon on the Mount. These are the words of Jesus Christ himself, the red-letter words. One day, as he saw the crowds gathering, Jesus went up on the mountainside and sat down. His disciples gathered around him, and he began to teach them. Do not judge others, and you will not be judged, for you will be treated as you treat others. The standard you use in judging is the standard by which you will be judged. And why worry about a speck in your friend's eye when you have a log in your own? How can you think of saying to your friend, let me help you get rid of that speck in your eye when you can't see the past the log in your own eye? Hypocritical, hypocrite. First, get rid of the log in your own eye, then you will see well enough to deal with the speck in your friend's eye. And this verse is very important. This is really the verse that I wanted to dedicate to Kathy. And I think you should listen to this going forward about who you allow in your life and don't allow. Don't waste what is holy on people who are unholy. Don't throw your pearls to pigs. They will trample the pearls, then turn and attack you. I've been in your shoes. Do your best not to let it happen again. But that doesn't mean you have to go away. You just have to go away from the people that are toxic to you. Go towards the people that are helpful and beneficial in your life. I'm praying for you, Kathy. I think, hope things get better for you. And I've spoken these words out of love and concern.